And I'm Emily Turner in San Francisco with the very latest when it comes to the reopening plan for the city. Of course, it's a rolling opening of sorts, but the one question on every parent's mind I know is when are your kids going to go back to school? We love them. Maybe it's nice to have them back in school for a little bit and give yourself a break, right? Well, the timeline is actually the slowest of all of the timelines when it comes to reopening. Now, uh, starting in mid-September, community learning, that's like those pods, those hubs, and K through six schools, those will be able to reopen with safety wa waivers. We are working towards trying to reopen, according to the city, middle schools. I guess it starts pretty much with the youngest ones and then moving towards the oldest ones. Middle schools, they're hoping, all the way through eighth grade. And non waiver K through six schools then to open by mid October. However, high schools are really the big question mark here because high school students transmit similar to adults, so they're being more cautious as they approach the reopening of high schools. All of that, however, is dependent upon us continuing to make progress in slowing the spread with reopening of businesses. What we have seen this year with our students, especially those students who may not have parents or grandparents or family support to help them in their lessons, even when we've provided them with devices and internet service, they are still falling further behind. It's why it was so important that we open these learning hubs and we are almost at capacity. Again, so there is a big push to get kids back in school because they recognize the importance of that in-person learning, but that's all dependent on being able to do that safely. Of course, this is again a rolling opening of sorts, uh, and we will have a full recap of this coming up in the next half hour. Reporting live in San Francisco, Emily Turner, KPIX 5. Well, an indoor visit to a 